Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Today is not going so well for Mr. Sam over there, if you can't tell by the title. But we're just waiting for our time to get COVID now because yes, this is how it happened. So Friday, he said he was having this little bit of a scratchy throat and a runny nose on the way home from work. And when he got home, he just stopped feeling that way. So he thought it was just um, chemicals from work or something. And then, when was it? Then Saturday, right? Okay, so Saturday, he started feeling a little bit worse, and he had been drinking the day before, so we thought it was like a hangover or something like that, and no, so then he told me that he was having a scratchy throat and a runny nose again, and uh, I decided I was just like, I'm going to test you for COVID just to rule that out. It's always negative every time we test ourselves for COVID and it ended up being positive positive. and since then he's just gone downhill he's not having breathing problems or anything but he's just having really bad body aches fever and headaches he has a pounding headache right now and i'm trying to stay away from him like as much as i can but this apartment's only so big we both have to be in the same places and there's just no getting around it so actually on friday night my sister wanted me to do her senior pictures so we met my mom and her 30 minutes away from here at this beautiful little place and i did her senior pictures so logan ended up going home with my mom but logan can't stay with my mom because they have work and school this week and things like that so we're just going to have to bring logan home today and i don't know hopefully he doesn't get it hopefully it's only sam because this week with sam he's been working long hours far away so basically he'll get up at 3 in the morning he'll be at work from or well, he'll be out of the house from 4 a.m. to 6 p.m. and then we still haven't been going to sleep till like 11 p.m. so he's only been getting three hours of sleep and so his immune system was obviously low he's always the last one to get sick or he doesn't get sick at all so I'm very surprised that he's sick right now I don't want to get it because I can just see how much pain he's in but I'm fine right now and there's nothing wrong with me but yeah, so that's what's going on with us. And also when we go pick up Logan, I'm going to get some more COVID tests just to make sure it was like the beginning for him because my mom was saying something like it could have just been the end of his test because his test was so light. Actually, I'll show you guys. See if you guys can see it. It's a very, very, very faint line, but it's still there. So we want to see if it gets darker or lighter. And then it would be interesting to see if like I have it, just no symptoms. I hope I have no symptoms if I get it. But yeah, Briella too, I hope she doesn't have anything. And if you guys are new to my channel, Victor, we got him when he was a week old. And when we got him, he had COVID and we didn't know. I saw that his lips were turning blue. I had a feeling that there was something wrong with him. We ended up taking him to Children's Hospital and he had COVID and his oxygen levels were down to 70%. So hopefully he doesn't get it again because we never know how it'll affect him this time around. So I don't know. I just hope that nobody gets sick from here on out. Just Sam. I'll show you guys him right now. Honestly, if I didn't have this headache and the body aches, I'd be perfectly fine. You know, like I could be wandering around the house. But that's what COVID does. Doing my normal thing, you know, like finishing Logan's bed and all that stuff. But oh man, this, this headache. It's insane. Exactly. Yeah, maybe some coffee here in a minute. I don't know. We'll see. But uh, I like told him this. to wait till his fever goes away because it was at 102.6, and I don't want him to drink hot coffee when he's already hot. Man, I thought everybody that got COVID was just being a bunch of sissies. Now I got it. Oh man. <laughs> that sucks. Yeah. I'm trying to stay away from you. And here's Miss Briella. She's just grubbing on her hands and she's laying down. Well, how are you, Briella? Are you getting sick? Look at me. Little miss. Are you getting sick? <coughs> oh, yeah? Are you hungry? Do you want to eat again? Yeah? You're so beautiful. Hi you guys, so I probably look like a mess right now, but I'm currently 30, 45 minutes away from my house. We're going to meet my mom halfway to pick up Logan, and I, before we came here I went to Walmart. I got Sam some Mucinex and Dayquil and Nyquil, and my mom's coming with McDonald's. Sam wanted to come because he thought that fresh air would help him feel better, and he's over there getting a fever again, so he took Dayquil, but 
and people are looking at me vlog, but. <laughs> Hi you guys, we just got home from picking Logan up and he has been crying for the past hour because he doesn't want to be with us and I am starting to feel a little bit sick. I have like a headache right now and my throat, I can feel some like mucus in there and there's like nowhere to quarantine away from each other in here so we're just all staying next to each other. All the kids are fine, Victor's eating right now, Briella just got out of her car seat. Logan's playing with Play-Doh, and then Sam is asleep on the bed, and yeah, so that's what's going on with us right now. I think I might take a test because there's I have some over there. Um, we have four tests, so let's hope that that I don't get it as bad as Sam because I have a lot of taking care of kids to do. <laughs> okay, you guys, so it's a little bit later. We got home. We started relaxing. Sam was asleep. He got up and he actually fell asleep out there on the couch. But I decided to take a COVID test and I'm positive. There we go. So I'm positive. I had a headache, but I took some Tylenol and I have like a little bit of mucus in my throat, but it's nothing too bad. So I decided to pick up the house so that I wouldn't. I decided to pick up the house just in case both of us are feeling down and out um, when it comes tomorrow or the next day. So the kitchen is clean, the living room is clean, our room is clean. <laughs> Logan, relax. Logan finally calmed down. He started building puzzles. He's watching Raya and the Last Dragon. He was playing with Play Doh and he started feeling better. But things are just going really weird right now. I don't really know. I never expected us to have COVID. It's our first time having COVID and I just don't really, I don't know what to do. And then like, obviously we can't quarantine just like away from Logan. So I don't know if he's going to end up getting it. I don't know if Riel is going to end up getting it. But the best thing we can do is just just be together and hydrate and eat and things like that so hopefully things don't get bad but I'll, I'll keep you guys updated I'm going to feed this girl hi you guys so it's the next day I have my retainer in so I sound a little weird but I officially have COVID yesterday I don't know if I showed you guys but I tested myself and I was positive and in the middle of the night Briella she started having a really high heart rate on the on the outlet and then I started giving her Tylenol and stuff because she ended up having a fever and then right after her I started getting body aches and stuff so I laid down and we slept on the couch and today has been the most horrible day ever. COVID is not a joke. I thought that I would be asymptomatic if I got it but I'm not and it sucks so much. I have a fever right now. Um, 102.7 I think so I'm waiting for the Tylenol to kick in so I can go take a shower because I'm really cold and my hands like the tips of my fingers were turning yellow and I think it's just because there's not a lot of, enough circulation to them but yeah I'm not posting a video right now and I probably won't post a video for like a few days because this is the worst sickness that I felt in a really long time like it tops the flu that I had in December when I was pregnant with Briella but here is Briella she keeps throwing up and having diarrhea and body aches and fever and all those nasty things. Sam is feeling better today. A little bit, but I'm still... He doesn't sore. have, um, like, a fever anymore, but he just has, like, a sore body. And he took another COVID test today for work. Logan! Calm down, please. And Logan is still good, too. Um, if this focuses, you guys will be able to see it. Mm. Come on! So there's Sam's test today. He is not going to work tomorrow and he has to help me with these sick babies. So I just thought I would give you guys an update on what's been going on with us because it's not good. 